Welcome to Perfect Guardian and I'll tell you the difference between Eurozone and EU. The Eurozone and EU both refer to entities that have been formed mainly by countries located in Europe. These two are quite similar to each other and are governed by a number of similar organizations such as the European Central Bank. The subtle differences between Eurozone and EU usually make the two very difficult to distinguish. However, they are different to each other mainly because one is a union formed based on a common currency while the other is a union formed based on facilitating better trade and economic activity. Now what is Eurozone? The Eurozone is a union of countries that use the same currency called the Euro. The Euro is used by 17 member states in the European Union which includes countries such as Belgium, Austria, France, Italy, Spain, Cyprus, Estonia etc. Since all members of the Eurozone use a common currency, the monetary policies of these countries are set by a common entity which is the European Central Bank. The ECB's main focus is on making sure inflation in the Eurozone is kept under control. There are a number of benefits in using a common currency for the Eurozone. This include no exchange rate, rate risk, facilitating better trade in terms of imports and exports, and strengthening of the stability of the currency even in terms of these currencies. The major disadvantage is in having to follow common economic policies that may not be conductive or con conducive to the very different economic and political conditions prevalent in each country. Now what is European Union? Means EU. The European Union is made of a number of countries who have come together to form a political and economic entity so that the governments may work together for the benefit of the member of the countries. There are a number of rules and requirements that must be met in order for countries to be included into the EU. And these member countries receive various benefits in doing so. There are 27 member countries in the EU. However, not all member countries use the euro as the currency. The main purpose in forming the EU was to facilitate better trade and free movement of goods and services, capital and other resources among the member countries. As such, these countries follow rules that allow them to follow the same trade pol policy, facilitating better trade within the EU. The main similarity between the US and Eurozone is that both these unions are formed by countries primarily in Europe. The EU refers to countries, the EU refers to countries that use a common currency and thereby enjoy benefits such as better international trade and currency stability. However, Disadvantages include having to follow the same monetary policies which will not suit the varying economic conditions in the member countries. The Eurozone is a union of countries that have come together to facilitate free trade and movement of resources, thereby improving economic conditions of all countries that are member. So, the Eurozone and EU both refer to entities that have been formed mainly by countries located in the Euro. These two are quite similar to each other and are governed by a number of similar organizations such as European Central Bank. They have quite distinctive differences mainly because one is a union formed based on a common currency while the other is a union based formed based on facilitating better trade and economic activity. Thank you. Please subscribe to my channel Perfect Guardian and give your comments.